to my channel, Shanice Danae here. So I wanted to create this video because a lot of you guys were asking me to do an updated skincare regimen. Now my regimen, please keep in mind, well first let's backtrack. Um, all the products that I had mentioned in my um, hyperpigmentation video and how to get rid of dark spots a lot of those a lot of those products i don't use every day the purpose of those products um, was to show you what i use in my full regimen so my regimen changes daily i listen to my skin whatever my skin tells me is what i do for it um now just i just wanted to kind of clear that up because a lot of you guys were like oh that's a lot of products i don't use all of those products every day now don't get me wrong i still use a lot of products but if you honestly think that you're only use one product that's going to work for your skin completely, the chances is about maybe 35%. Um, and it just doesn't work for me. And I'm also a licensed esthetician, and I literally try chemical pills. You have to be careful with that when you're um, when you're darker skin tone, um, because you can end up creating more dark spots. So there's a lot of if you have sensitive skin like me, you have to be very very careful. So so let's get started into this video guys and I use three cleansers no matter what um, I use the foaming cleanser the Aveeno and the vitamin C wash by face and glory those are all three products that I use and I only use each product once now usually when you think about it usually when you wash your face you wash it about three times right like am I the only person that like there's no way that you wash your skin one time you at least do it twice two to three times so what's the difference between using three different products now I use this one because it again it clears it, it really gets my skin really clean and that's one of the reasons why I like using it so right now I'm using the equate beauty cleanser I'm not sure if you're familiar with acne.org I'm not sure if you're familiar with acne.org but um, one of the reasons why a lot of people like it because it's hypoallergenic it doesn't have a lot of chemicals or anything like that in it and that's the same thing for this one so that's why i like using it so next i'm just going to go with the soap and glory um a vitamin wash i told you guys i am like absolutely in love with this stuff it's amazing and it's affordable i don't know about you but i, I always say that i love to save my coins i just think it's key to do that but sometimes when you're too cheap you don't get you get cheap results but with this for some reason it works for me um yeah so i'm just drying off my face trying not to get my lashes wet because <laughs> i just got them done um but yeah so next i'm going to use the aveeno cleanser this stuff is about seven dollars i showed you guys this in the hyperpigmentation video and all I'm doing is just literally I use each product one time. Now, if you have dry skin, make sure that you're using products that work best for dry skin. I have oily skin, so this doesn't overly dry out my skin. Um, so again, if you're using three cleansers or even two cleansers, just make sure that you're um, paying attention to that and listening to your skin. Okay guys, so next we're going to use the Glam Glow Brightening Mask. I believe that this is the only one that they have. Now this product, I use a lot of different um, exfoliators and I only use this about once a month. And the reason why is mainly because it has a lot of little fine like grains in it and you don't want to use it too much because you'll scratch the surface of your skin. Um, and then honestly that's not good for anybody so just be careful. Okay, so after you're using that, you want to use the rose petal, well, any toner that you have, really. But the rose petals, rose water, I like it because it's good for sensitive skin. It's, it, honestly, it does its job. And if you have any redness in your skin, it helps get rid of that or any inflammation in your skin. So if you have really bad cystic acne, this is, would be a great toner for you. Um, and then I'm going to follow up with the Neutrogena's Clear Face Oil-Free SPF 55. I feel like that was a lot. I was really trying to get all of that out in one breath. And yeah, so um, I like to use a pretty good amount of this. Um, now, if you're using makeup, you want to use a little bit so that way you're not like all oily by the end of the day but um, since it's hot in Florida and the Sun is very strong here in Florida um, I always make sure that I have an SPF and I highly highly recommend that you use one in your regimen as well 
Okay guys, so that pretty much is the basics um, in regards to my skincare. I always make sure that I use an exfoliator, a cleanser, a toner, and a moisturizer. All of the products that I had showed you guys in my previous video, I literally use all of them, not at the same time, but I do alternate them in my regimen. I hope that this video was helpful. Make sure you comment, rate, and subscribe for more videos. And if you like me, give me a little hearts at the bottom. Bye guys. <laughs>